Well, Graham, you, you stay cool. You don't really show emotion too much ups or downs. You did then. That meant a lot, didn't it? Well, I think it's, uh, you can see how many times we've won here as a club. It's not, a, it's not easy. It's not something that happens all the time. So I think when you do get the three points, it's nice to celebrate with our supporters. They were fantastic throughout the game, helping us out. They, they could appreciate the team, the quality of the performance. And then when we needed to suffer, which you inevitably have to here, we, we managed to do that. So it's a nice moment. Um, and now we have to prepare for the next one. Historic win. First time ever for Brighton at Old Trafford. What's the biggest deal with the team's performance today, aside from the result? What, what, was, what was right? Everything? Well, you have to be as close to perfect as, as you can when you're playing here, I think. And um, with the atmosphere, with the anticipation of the change of coach and a new season and what the home crowd brings, you, you can be under pressure quite quickly. So I thought we managed that situation quite well. We managed to put pressure on them to make it a little bit nervy at times and we won the ball back and managed to attack well. I thought we had a couple of opportunities before we scored to to maybe open the scoring so no the, the, the guys were amazing I mean it's, it's uh, it was a top performance it was a, a performance with real courage real responsibility and uh, I'm very proud of them you've lost two key players from your squad this summer I'm thinking of Cook at the back particularly what about that back unit mm. so terrific today they did really well and it's again not easy because there's a lot of movement and a lot of their interchange uh, but again like I said they took responsibility um, showed courage to defend in the way they did and as a team, I thought we, you know, from Danny, from from Adam, Solly, and Leo, uh, as the forward players, they, they they defended all over the pitch, covers for each other. Um, and as, like I said, as a coach, when you see your players do that, taking responsibility, then it's uh, you've got a chance. No new signings in your starting line today. I know you'll be working, continuing to the end of August to see what you can do. But is there much to be said for a settled ship, solid? Everybody knows their work. Well, we said before, we're quite calm with, with what we do and how we work. I mean, it's it's not so straightforward. I think the last three windows is £150 million of player sales. So, by definition, that isn't so e easy to manage. But when the group is is what it is and there's ambition and there's hard work and there's humility and everybody's trying their best, then, like I say, you can you can, you can can achieve things. What's the aim this season? Same as? I think, as I said before, you have to have two positions when, you, when you're us, which is... We have to fight every day for the points because to stay in the Premier League is very, very tough. Everybody's competing, everybody's strong. Um, and if you can do that, then, then also then you have to have hope and ambition and who knows. But uh, the first bit is always to, to make sure you stay humble, stay respectful of how difficult the competition is and do our best.